hello everyone welcome back to the channel you know it's wolf here and i'm <laughs> offending everybody let's see let's get back to these people <sighs> why nobody loves you what a title what a title i've been really enjoying this dude's videos <laughs> recently dog they funny and they offensive as hell and I'm all here for it. Hopefully you guys have a sense of humor and you're here for it also. So <laughs> like and subscribe to the channel, share the video, all of that stuff. Yeah, if you're new to the channel. And let's get these people. You know it's your wolf. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. When you look in the mirror, what do you see? Is it disgust? Of course it is, because you're disgusting. But that doesn't Why mean do you can't you be loved. So here's that. That trick people. <laughs> yeah. Is it disgust? That's cool. Of course it is. Because you're disgusting. Yo, this dude, I can see that he is projecting heavily though. <laughs> well, yeah, yeah, I interrupted it too early. When you look in the mirror, what do you see? Is it disgust? Of course it is. Because you're disgusting. But that doesn't mean you can't be loved. So here's how to trick people into loving you. Number one, your parents. Your parents definitely don't love you. Sure, they say it, but that's more from guilt than choice. Believe me, if they could click that restart button, they would. 45 oh and still my. living in your hometown? You think that's where Deb saw her life? No. If anything, you're a constant reminder of their failures. Your mere <sighs> existence brings them anguish. But all this can change if you bring them grandchildren. <laughs> Babies are like toys for old people, or it doesn't matter how hard they play, because someone else is paying for it. And let's be honest, you're kind of hoping dads to make- Oh my gosh. No matter how hard they play, someone else is paying for it. And the grandparents always spoil the children, I'm telling you. How you were raised compared to how they are treating your, your children, you know? Their grandchildren. Saying, no, don't, don't, no, don't. Don't put, don't, don't spank them. Don't, be, don't, don't, don't whoop them. It will traumatize them. You, you didn't think it would traumatize me? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I'll tell you. I, I turned out, I turned out great, bro. Because I'm, <laughs> I'm not on the street corner <laughs> slinging or toting a pistol or locked up, you know? So I, I appreciate those whoop, whoopings. Meant your brain mistakes a little Billy for laundry detergent, just washing away all your problems. But in all seriousness, <laughs> kids give your parents life purpose. Your mom keeps staring at her Xanax prescription, and your dad is one fender bender away from saying, Today's the day! They need <laughs> this. Sure, they'll break your balls about being a free babysitter, but that's like having to buy a purse before butt play. It's the uh, cost of doing business. So if you want Christmas to be a little less depressing, then try introducing Why? them to joy. Number Why two, your siblings. All you have to do is be reliable. Car broke down, death in family, Minecraft mod adding occasional buffer. You better be there. Siblings don't really care about your dreams or problems. They're just happy you brought jumper cables. You see, you're more of a tool for their convenience. They're never inviting you to the top of the pool parties. No, it's always we need to dig a grave or ditch the car. And you can't narc on them. Narcan is the quickest way to write yourself out of the will. However, there are limits. Like if your brother reveals his favorite dinosaur is Diddle Source, then it's time to distance yourself. His she acts mature for her age is not going to hold up in court. But no. if their menu doesn't include a kid's section, then you're stuck with them. Blood is thicker than water, and that's why they trust you to hold the shovel. Yeah, you're back hurts and you're not sure if you turned off your location but remember nothing says love like a loyal accomplice number three your what? friends if you want your friends to love you then all you need to do is risk serious bodily harm doing a backflip off the roof that i show speed video bro that i show speed video that's that that's that's crazy right that's crazy is the quickest way to become a living legend or cripple legend if you over rotate yeah. the point is you're still a legend you don't think they're gonna be happy to see your spaghetti legs at the hospital john's wailing on your shin saying you seriously don't feel this he's too insecure to give you a hug so this is all the physical love you're gonna receive but remember Aye. there's a big difference between being a dumb fuck and a fuck up a dumb fuck will get himself arrested a fuck up will get you arrested so choose your friends wisely because we all love hearing <laughs> i bought fireworks but not oh god there were kids in this Steve, we need to go there were kids we in need this. to go <laughs> number four your spouse for women love can be bought Car. Oh my god, there was kids in there. Oh my god, there was kids in there. That took Yo, that took a turn. That escalated. That was bro. That, oh my god, there was kids. In there houses, Laker you tickets, can all turn logo into hubby material. You see, women are basically TikTok, just randomly swiping to the next thought or emotion. They need stuff to distract their erratic squirrel brain. Gucci bag, wedding ring, Botox, 
Come here. Just a little further. For men, love can also Dang. be bought, but your submission is the currency. Daddy's looking to get rid of his poison. Okay, now be a good girl and open up. I give you financial security, you give me the cheeks. That's the deal. I know you weren't a corn star coming into this relationship, but remember, the position always has openings. You said you were good at school, so start taking notes. You see how she's not <laughs> gagging? or crying. Yeah, so how about you start loosening up that jaw and wiping away those tears, because nothing says love quite like <coughs> Number five. Dang, yo, 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 you just said the quiet, quiet part out loud, though. A part that, like, is, <laughs> yo, it shouldn't be transactional, but in certain cases, it, it feels like it, because sometimes uh, a partner gets treated like a hoe, and uh, well, a woman gets treated like a hoe. And the man gets treated treated like a wallet. So why are you upset <laughs> when someone asks you to perform the function? <laughs> and I'm a, I'm, a, I'm and I'm talking about both sides right here. You should not, because that's in, insensitive, and that reduces people to the to just the basic things that they can provide. But dang, dang, people. People need to romanticize um, things and overcomplicate it so it doesn't feel like they are being used, you know? And in, it's, in most cases, it's genuine, but when you distill it down to, to just beer facts. <laughs> yeah. Yourself. Be honest, when you look in the mirror, you see disgust. And quite frankly, you should. Look at you. That no. body, that face. Oh, but don't let this get you down. <laughs> Use it as data. Because if you hate yourself, then others probably do too. You think yeah. you're the only one with that primitive emotion in your simple monkey brain? No. Hell, women are basically preloaded with self loathing. Their first words are, I will never be good enough. They don't know what it means yet, but they know how it makes them feel. Worthless. Dang. So the trick to loving yourself is accepting you're disgusting, but not as disgusting. Oh, shoot. As, as soon as he said that. I think about the freaking girls that get plastic surgery and, and injections before they're mature. <clears throat> and it makes them look like they, they're freaking prehistoric, I'm telling you. They look like something from, from when cave people existed. <laughs> Well, now let's continue. Disgusting as others. Mike simps for e-girls. Tom is on his third DUI. Billy brought a Nizuko body pillow to school! And you think they're what? better? You're not the one failing chemistry! Face it, most people are trash. So start using the judgment hammer to build your ego. Is Tom wearing a gamer headset in public? Did Mike just post a shirtless selfie? Is Becky about to have her third kid with her third baby daddy? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Revel in other people's suffering to make yourself feel better. You will be a piece of. You will become a piece of a piece of <laughs> of crap, you know. But at least you make it, you yourself feel you feel better about yourself. I'll tell you. <laughs> no, don't do that. Just just freaking improve yourself. You know, improve yourself. Just just well, if you, if you have some weight that you want that you don't you're not, you don't feel comfortable about. Put down the food and go to the gym. If you feel too scrawny, you want to build muscle, go to the gym. <laughs> Eat some food. <laughs> yeah. If you don't like how you look, try out a different hairstyle, you know? Um, girls, you know, don't go under the knife. I'm telling you. Just, just, just find someone that loves you for you. <laughs> That's all I can say. That's all I can say. Well, because you want someone that is good to look at. There are other people that want someone that is good to look at. And then that person is not going to feel like they need to love you for you because it keeps rotating. You know, it, it keeps coming in. Oh, you know, I do feel a little better. So that's my vid on how to get people to love you. But if you want to know the true secret, it's stop. Stop trying to fit in. Stop worrying about what others think. Stop waiting for love to validate your existence. Girl. Everyone is just as lost, confused, and insecure as you are, if not more. They're all slapping filters on their lives, pretending they're winning, <laughs> when deep down they're True. drowning in the same I'm just a burden thoughts. So stop wasting your time chasing their approval when it's clear you don't need it. No, you need to realize that just existing in this fucked up world is proof you're stronger than you think. Just think about all yes, those days. Yes, because a lot of people just... Yeah. Yeah. They just eat, my G. They just eat. They just, ah. Yo. Whether it's from bullying, whether it's from freaking, yeah. Un 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 unfortunate circumstances, you know. Whether it's, ah. 
people pr- pressuring them and forcing them, you know? Yeah. They just freaking take a leap of faith, I'm telling you. Days that try to break you, all those rejections that cut deep, all yes. those dark thoughts telling you to just do it, do it, uh, do uh, it! And you, yes. You're still standing. Yeah. True. Or sitting, depending on how high that roof was. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I miss you, Jimmy. No. I know what's next, but they... <laughs> it's true, though. It's true. It's true. That la- that last part was was real. It was kind of real, you know? It was kind of real. And, guys, if you enjoyed the reaction, you know what to do. The subscribe button is there. The share button is there. The like button is there. Click them, you know? <laughs> it helps me out a lot because YouTube is not pushing my videos, I'm telling you. They are now. Ah, but um, that's 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 it, people. <laughs> Come back to the channel for another reaction. Yeah, I got some some uh, some music reactions to come. CJ the CJ the champ just dropped a new video. I'ma check that out too. So later, people. Ah, it's so peace out. Itekimas. Let's get this. Let's get it.